New at 10, what's that smell? There's a strong stench in Cedarburg and people say it has been lingering for weeks. Sulfury, like eggs, like coming from hell or something. Hey, what, is what is it, decomposing vomit? You're lucky we don't have smell of vision tonight because as people in Cedarburg will tell you, that stink is no joke. Rebecca Clough is live there tonight getting some answers on where it's coming from and what's being done about it. I'm sorry for this assignment, Rebecca. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Yeah, Stephen, Shannon, rotten eggs, sulfur. Those are some of the nice ways people are describing the stench that's coming out of the Kemp's plant here. And people say it's so strong they can smell it from more than a half a mile away. There's something definitely in the air in Cedarburg, and people aren't mincing words about it. How would you describe it? Sewage. Sometimes it smells like a wet dog. Decomposing vomit. Sulfury, like eggs, like coming from hell or something. People say it's been going on for weeks, mainly in the south part of the city, but the smell has made it all the way to Washington Avenue, more than a half a mile away by the Piggly Wiggly and Starbucks. I can smell it through my car. It's been probably like a month at least. Oh, yeah. Earlier today, the city released this statement saying a private company in the city had a pipe break and it's giving off an offensive smell to its surrounding areas. The city told us to contact the Kemp's plant for more information. Tonight, a spokesperson for Kemp's say they're not sure where the smell is coming from. They released a statement saying we are partnering with a third party consultant to help identify the root cause and will work with our team to provide a solution. But for families living downwind, they just want the smell to end. Definitely something that I'm not happy about. <laughs> they should get on it. Even four-year-old Jack O'Brien knows something is off in his neighborhood. It smells like vanilla. What do you do when it smells that bad out? I do it. Good advice, Jack. Well, the company says that they did have experts in today and they hope that the air is going to be smelling better by tomorrow. But again, they haven't pinpointed what exactly is causing the smell, so they're still looking for that. We, of course, will be following it and bringing you updates as we get them. Reporting live, Rebecca Clough, today's CMJ4.